Speaker Yoshi Kun on Tuesday received a delegation of representatives from several European countries at the Legislative Yuen. Among them were parliamentarians from North Macedonia and Romania, as well as the partially recognized state of Kosovo. It marked the first time that a cross-country, cross-party delegation from the Balkans visited the legislature. The delegation was led by former Kosovo Prime Minister Abdullah Hoti, who pointed out that both Taiwan and Kosovo face challenges from an unfriendly neighbor. Let's hear from him. It happened that we share, we share the same faith. We have neighbors who are not very friendly towards us. But historically speaking, democracy always prevails and determination always prevails. With my limited information, I can ensure you that you have supporters all over the world. Some are vocal, some are less vocal, but they fully support you. When your country declared independence, Taiwan was among the first to recognize you. Kosovo has a neighbor watching it closely like a tiger. Meanwhile, Taiwan is at the receiving end of military threats from authoritarian China. The 13-person delegation visited the Legislative Yuan also to watch a legislative interpolation session. They said they were very interested in the process, taking photographs and asking questions throughout. Hody, who is also a co-chair in the Interparliamentary Alliance on China, had sat with President Tsai Ing-wen the day before. During his meeting with her, he said preparations were being made to further cooperate with Taiwan.